So today I wanted to continue working on getting our gold count up, and apparently I'm alerting these things because I didn't pay attention to the wind, so maybe we can just start off with one really quick if he wants to go alert for me. That'll work pretty good. But basically, I've been, like, shooting a bunch of mule deer trying to get respawns, and I think it was on Monday's stream we went over 4,800, so we're now at 4,817. And just like to get a break from Parquet Fernando, I thought we'd come to Verhunga because, well, for one, the break, the other, I think Verhunga just happens to be like a map where a really high percentage of animals just make gold, like more than some of the other maps. So I thought that'd be good and just for a bit of a change because I feel like I haven't hunted Verhunga a whole lot this year, but it should be good. We should be able to get our count up, hopefully at least to, I'd say, 4830 anyway. But... I was talking about working on respawns, and I actually kind of want to do it with the Cape Buffalo as well, because I really want like a bigger horns diamond Cape Buffalo, so I'm probably going to hang out here and at least kill this other mythical, and maybe that level 7 too. Okay, that one's the 7. I don't even know if that's like a bigger 7, but we're going to try to get him since he's here. Need to hopefully get his attention. And basically, if he weighs more than 802 kilos, then he's kind of what I want. So if you don't know what I'm talking about, or like a lot of you guys have asked me kind of like what I mean when I say respawns, and specifically like respawns towards diamond, there was a stream where the devs kind of said like basically animals try to respawn in their weight class most of the time. So that Cape Buffalo there, that 821 to 950, he should always be a 7, 8, or 9 in that weight class. And that's kind of the idea here. We want anything above 802 because that's the minimum on the estimate. So this dude's 810. If we weren't using Zag Tactics, we would see 802 to 950 on his track. So that is essentially what we're looking for. And hopefully then, that Mythical is going to work his way back here and we can get him. Okay, so finally found him. He'll probably turn around and give us a shot here in a minute. But just one more quick thing about respawns just to like clarify and everything. I don't actually know what makes respawns happen, so like with those two K buffalo that we just shot, I don't know what we have to do before two new males are going to spawn in their place. Um, but as far as i found, like the best thing to do is just kill a bunch of animals, I think specifically of the same species, but honestly I'm not sure. So if you've like heard me say when people ask that pretty much you just want to shoot everything, that's why, because I really don't know what you have to do to get the respawns. But that does seem to be the best, so, like, that's what I'm doing with a mule deer. I'm just killing literally every buck. And that's what I would do in this video if I was doing respawns, but we are specifically after gold, so just going to be picking out some of the bigger ones. Now, if we can alert this dude, hopefully he'll cooperate. And hopefully we can drop him. Good chance that rabbit actually makes gold. Why did that one stay? That one's not big enough. But if we can hit it. If it's big enough, we'll take that too. But yeah, that wasn't too bad. This guy's smaller mythical, just 890, but we'll take that for the respawn reason. And our rabbit. A lot of these don't make gold, but it was a two. And it is. And I thought we were going to be going for lions, but there's a bunch of Gemsbuck here. I think that's really the only one we should bother with. Level 3 females can make gold, so... Maybe if she wants to feed... I'm actually surprised that worked. So I tried to get the spinal cord, like, that way. And I assume that's what we got, so... We'll take it. And that one's gonna make it as well. 808, so that's 5 golds. And we're literally, like, just starting this. And I swear... I thought I saw a lion. That's probably a maybe buffalo I'd like to shoot, but it's just fleeing, and I do hear a lion somewhere. That guy. Six can definitely make it, so I guess we'll try to get him. I don't know if a 300 meter shot's really a good idea, but we're gonna go for it. And then if we can. He's not gonna cooperate, is he? We might have gotten full quick kill anyway. I was going to say we'll throw a follow-up in there, but it's kind of difficult when they're running that fast. 
I swear, there's a lion down there. I can see him. I knew that I could see one before. I can't spot it. And I don't know what the plan is, but... We're gonna try to get him one way or another. So I got him to move. He's just alert there. I don't know if I can maybe just kill him. Okay, that definitely didn't drop him. It's gonna throw a kind of prayer shot in there and hope that we got him. Actually, maybe we did. He died pretty quick. And that's a female, so that's not gonna help us, but maybe that'll work. I mean, he's dead right there where we shot, so maybe we had some kind of really dumb luck. But he is actually a gold. What the heck? I got the brain shot the second time? Okay. Not gonna complain about it. That's not even what I was aiming for, but I'll take it. That got another gold on the list. And actually, we got full quick kill. I thought we must have gotten the liver, because just with the shot being that far... And the time the bullet had to get there, he would have taken another step, but he was too small. But still, for the number of, like, maybe goals that we shot, we're doing pretty good. I don't know where that one's going. The one thing is, like, with the wind being bad, I kind of want to alert him and just get him while he's broadside. Or honestly, we can probably just hit him. Pretty sure that'll be good. It's gonna be close, but I think we got it. Ooh, he actually lost a little bit, but he was still big enough. He's 811. I had tracks from two other lions heavier than that one. So we should have at least two more gold somewhere on this lake. I just don't know like where the heck they are. But maybe if we can find them. Alright, that's one of them. I actually spooked the other one. But, that's him, and I'm assuming, yeah, it's going to be the other track I had, so as long as he'll come back. Did he just turn? I think he did stop in there, but I don't think I should take any kind of risky shots. We already almost lost one earlier. But I think that's going to be our seventh gold, or maybe eighth. What are we at? We're at 825, so yeah, that's our eighth. And I believe the other line just kind of spooked down that way. You know what? Because he just spooked. If I can hit that. Well, level threes can make it. And I see our lion. Might have just spooked him further, but that's alright. At least now I know he's in the open and we should be able to get him. But if we can pull a bonus gold out of that. That would be pretty good. I think we'd be at ten after the lion. Assuming this guy would make it. And he's just a little bit short, so we'll just focus on the lion then. And honestly, if he wants to sit still for a minute, I can definitely get that. Ooh, I missed the heart, though. What the heck are these shots? Where did I hit that one? I don't know that we would have gotten enough quick kill without a follow-up, but we hit something good there. Oh, actually, okay, so we got that weird double lung where you could just hit them both through the front, and I guess just like hitting flesh was enough to kill him. We were still going to drop a little bit, which is actually kind of surprising. That wasn't that far a shot, but all right, less impressive than I thought, but a gold nonetheless. Ooh, that I thought for a second might have been... Really good. That's not okay. But that's just a normal four. But we will take those. That'll be number ten for us. So we got this bring buck during time, and I thought we'd come back here where we started. But, uh... We can always rely on this spot right outside the lodge to have something. And honestly, he's not even that big. I don't know what about him made me think he was way bigger. But that's gold number 10 on the hunt, and I wanted to get to 13, so hopefully we can get three more. Maybe that herd over there can help us? That's actually a big one. Still a four, but a little bigger than the one we just shot. 
How far actually is that? Because this is a weird spot. It's actually like 250. Because I don't actually know, because of the way the vegetation is, if I should try to get over there. So we'll just do that. And then we don't have to worry about spooking them. And that's actually, I think... Maybe a three that has a chance? We're gonna kill it anyway. I don't know where I hit that. It's definitely not where I was aiming, but we're just gonna pretend it is. And if that guy makes it, then we'll only need one more. But yeah, actually decent horns on that one. He's 889. Not too bad, 260 meters. Pretty much nailed the drop on it, right through the heart. And the other one is further up this way. And just a silver. Actually, I think they need to have like more mass on their horns to make gold at level 3. I'm not sure. But I'm trying to think of where else to go. We could actually go to this lake again. I think we'll give that a shot because Springbuck drink here too. So there's another 4. Actually, he's pretty good as well, but the angle's terrible. Okay, it's like he heard me. So we're looking at like the same range. Hopefully, we can go with similar result as well. Yeah, not too bad. 862 and double one. So we need one more. And I honestly didn't even see any threes in that herd, so we might try fast traveling one more time. Okay, so that guy could be what we're looking for. He's got the horns that can make gold on a level three. So, we're going to hope he's got high enough trophy rating, because I don't think a level 3 can get much above, like, maybe 820 or 830, so not a really good chance. Although, 37 kilos? I'd say he probably is big enough. It's actually been long enough since I've really paid attention to, like, where gold is on spring buff that I don't know for sure, but, I mean, 38, I think, is the max estimate. And yeah, 803. Not bad. So that's our 13th gold, and that will bring us then to 48.30 for our total. And we're 170 away, so making pretty good progress on that. And maybe, we don't know, but maybe good progress on Cape Buffalo respawns for the Bighorns Diamond. That is yet to be determined, but anyway, that's going to do it for now. So thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time.